Yo, what's up YouTube? Rapper here, back with another U My Team video, and uh, they did drop new, um, new um, moments cards today. Um, of course, the James Harden is still available for, I think, 18 minutes. It'll probably be over by the time this video is already out, but uh, that's also still available. But um, the Kyrie, they came out with a Diamond Kyrie Irving, Amethyst Rudy Gobert, uh, Jerry Allen, um, and a Zubak. I'm expecting the Kyrie might be pretty good. He had a pretty good game last game. He had a lot of assists. I think that was like the biggest part of his game. So they might give him Hall of Fame Dimer. I'm not sure. But we'll look at the stats real quick. But this is his third diamond of the year. Um, so um, if we can find a card here. It's not going to be... I hate having to go through all these because like clearly... I mean, I know this... Um. I know the the one with the green jersey is pretty good as well. Um, I know it gets it's pretty much a, like a bucket, but I, I just don't like having guards like Kyrie. He's not really the best. Probably probably the cards defense isn't the best, and you know they can score, but there's plenty of cards that can score and play defense at the point guard spot. So you know it's just better options out there. I mean for a budget team, he's definitely a good guy to have on the squad. The um the one with the white jersey though is not as good definitely for sure but um this is the new Kyrie he's has a 98 offense 88 defense he's 6-3 um 94 overall um he comes with ankle breaker and difficult shots hall of fame so he comes with two hall of fame badges doesn't come with um diamond hall of fame though um um even though he you know he had 18 assists but you know it's okay mid-range also comes with mid-range dead eye one man fast break deep range dead eye limitless range uh, which is a good badge as well Pickpocket, corner specialist, dimer, pick and run, maestro, tire score, catch and shoot, relentless finisher, acrobat, and teardropper. Um, he comes with a nice seven driving layup. Also, a he comes with an open shot three of 85, um, which is probably gonna be a lot better than it seems because um, his release is very good in this game. Honestly, like I, I honestly really like his release, and his mid range jump shot is a uh, 95. Um, of course, he's not going to be a dunker, but um, you know, I expected out of him. 99 ball control. Not a lot of cards that have 99 ball control. I don't even think they gave Matt Johnson 99 ball control, so that's really good as well. Um, and he also has so, and I think he, he had ankle breaker Hall of Fame. So his his he's going to be able to really be able to snatch ankles like crazy. Comes with 98 passing stats all around. Uh, 84 shot contest was solid, and then 65 steals. So he's um. Which is not that good, so he's not gonna be able to steal the ball like that. But that's okay, I guess. I mean, it, it's all right. 95 speed, which is what you want in your point guard. Also, 95 speed with ball and acceleration. Um, stamina 97, solid. 75 lateral quickness and 82 on ball defense. Not the best defender. Um, looking at the stats, but he is pretty good at um pass perception, which is really big since you know um, getting steals off ball is actually really good in this game. So uh, that's pretty solid. Um, so the card's probably gonna be pretty good. Um. Definitely the best Kyrie that's in the game right now. Uh, I probably would say he's not that much better than this um, this Kyrie, um, except for having a Hall of Fame um, difficult shots, which is definitely a big deal. But you know he still has pretty crazy stats as well. And I believe this car is actually a slight. It seems like a slightly better defender, and I think he has he has three points better than a three point shot. I know this had this had a shoe on it. Um, but I'm not sure. Well, let me see if I can find one without a shoe on it because I think that might affect that might affect the defense as well. Um, here we go. Here we go. Um, so yeah, yeah, defense is pretty much the same. Um, 88, so a little bit better of a shot three. Um, 98 ball control instead of, but the passing stats are definitely a lot different. Um, a little bit worse defense. Um, when it comes to shot contests and same speed though. So I mean the cards are pretty similar. Um, I'd probably say there's not a big enough difference where I would pay an insane amount for the new Kyrie. The new Kyrie probably price will drop though, to be honest. But I'm um, going on to the next player. I think the next best player is the uh, Rudy Gobert. This card probably gonna be selling for really cheap, but he's gonna be pre he's probably gonna be pretty decent. I mean, seven he's a seven one center, so he's gonna play defense pretty well. Comes with brick wall, bruiser, chase down armor, firm protector, defensive stopper, lobsy, pat finisher, post riser, put back king, pick and roller, and hustle rebounder. Comes with it. Doesn't have any type of jump shot. Um, comes with the same nine driving layup, but 97 contact. I mean, uh, standing layup, 95 uh, standing drop, uh, standing dunk, 85 driving dunk, 75 contact. Also, that comes with a 97 block and 97 shot contest, which is obviously really good. He's also really long, so he's gonna be a really good shot blocker. 97 one. Um, comes with uh, 94 rebounding all around, 58 speed, so he's gonna be one of the slower big men. Um, 
and on all ball defense, 73 lock quickness, which is not bad for a big man. So this card's why I would be, yeah, I probably wouldn't suggest picking this card up. I mean, you probably won't go, f like, I probably wouldn't pick him up for any more than 10K. Probably won't be picking him up at all, to be honest, for me. But, um, I don't know. Uh, it's, I mean, it's a solid card, but it's definitely not the best card in the world. Um, I know Zubak got a new card as well. Probably Again, it probably won't be too good. Might be able to stretch the floor a little bit, though. He's a 7-1 center. Comes with 88 offense, 87 defense. Comes with brick wall, hustle runner, pick and roller, lopsy um, finisher, and posterizer. Um, comes with an A2 open, open shot mid-range. So he's at least going to be able to shoot a mid-range jump shot. Um, comes with a 95 standing dunk, 80 driving dunk, and 70 um, contact. Um, also comes with an 85 block, 80 shot, shot contest, 85 shot contest. Um, and also solid rebounding with 95 offense, 92 defense, 90 box out, 65 speed. So he's going to be a bit on the slow side as well. Um, so, and on ball defense, 78, 45 lateral quickness. So he's not going to be able to guard on, you know, any guards or anything like that. So he's not really going to be able to switch on screens very well. But that's not too big of a deal. I honestly would say this card probably, I probably would rather have this card than the Rudy Gobert, to be honest. Because, um, just because of the mid-range and the stats aren't, the defensive stats is, and stuff aren't too bad um so i probably would take that card over um i probably would take that card over uh um the rudy gobert but i know there was one more card that's out um jared allen here you go um jared, that card actually might be better than um i'm actually that actual card probably might be decent as well um he comes with a5 um, offense 92 defense he's 611 um, so he's going to be shorter than Rudy Gobert, but he's going to pretty much do the same things. Run protector, defensive stopper, hustle rebounder, pick and roller, and put back king. Um, comes with a uh, 95 of open shot close, shot close, which is actually pretty good. Same three mid range, so he's going to be able to knock it down every once in a while. With dimer, probably be pretty good. Um, comes with 85 sand dunk, 85 driving dunk, same five contact. Um, block is 95, 88 shot test is solid. Solid rebound as well with 94 offensive and uh, 96 um, defensive speed is 79, so that's actually pretty good for a big man. Um, he's gonna be a lot faster than Rigo Burt, so that might make him a bit. I probably say I probably take this card honestly over Rigo Burt to be honest, um, because his blocking ability is pretty much on par with Rigo Burt's, and he's just as long and stuff. But he's gonna be faster, a lot faster than Rigo Burt. So yeah, that card should be pretty decent as well. Um, but yeah. Uh, if you enjoyed the video, go ahead and leave a like. There's also, like I think I said at the beginning, there's also a new lock code. I'll, I will put it in the description. The lock code in the description. And, um, uh, like I said, leave a like and subscribe for more. Peace out.